until um, probably the next day or two. And as we get further information, or if more information comes to light, I'll uh, certainly share that with you. But at the moment, that's all I've got. The man who was in the front yard, are you able to clarify who he was and how he was related to the issue? First, I've heard about a man in the front yard. The woman who was taken to the hospital, um, what sort of condition is she in? What, what her age is she? Um... She's a 34 year old woman, uh, I believe, and it's very, very early days that she's in a stable condition. So this is the same woman who's assisting police that inquires the one taken to hospital? But uh, Yes, she is. Is it, is it clear who contacted uh, police and, and the animals? No, not at this stage. I've uh, just walked onto the scene, but I can say this. Uh, as it stands at the moment, uh, there's no need for the public to be concerned uh, about this, other than the fact that it's a tragic, tragic event. Uh, the situation is well controlled at the moment. There no, shouldn't be any concern for anyone else out of this environment. And uh, as we progress further, we'll be um, sharing the results of our investigation. Sorry, can you tell us the relationship between the 34-year-old woman and the 18-month-year-old um, and the 16-year-old? No, I'm sorry, I can't right now. It's just too early for me. Uh, we need to do a lot more work, as you can imagine. The crime scene is being locked down. Uh, it's, that includes from me. Uh, nobody goes in there until our forensic people are finished. And uh, until we have done that...